this here okay Hi guys, welcome back to my channel with Megan Andin. Today I'm gonna cook pot rolls with this pressure cooker that I just got. This one is called Simpot by Symphonia. Hi guys, today I would like to show you a brand new pressure cooker I just got from Amazon. This is an electric 6 quart pressure cooker called Simpot by Symphonio. I love this kitchen gadget because of the advantages that this product offers. You basically can cook everything here, from cooking rice, egg, soup, saute, steam, even cake and yogurt. Unlike other pressure cookers, Simpot has a super large 4.5 inch LCD screen making it easier to operate. Okay, before I start cooking, I'm gonna show it to you guys. Uh, this pressure cooker, co pressure cooker comes with rice paddle, soup ladle, and this this cute silicon glove thread. This is so cute. <laughs> Look at this. And come with measuring cup. Uh, the inside, you can see, it come with the steamer basket, and of course the. The stainless steel uh, bucket, and this one is a recipe book, and of course the the specification. You can see inside here how to set up your uh, pressure cooker. I can't wait to cook with this pressure cooker that I just got. So let's start cooking. This is the chuck pot roast that I bought. It's uh, Angus Premium Choice Beef Chuck Pot Roast. This one is um, 2.43 per pound. Um, I'm sorry, a total of 2.43 pound. And the prices, as you can see, is 5.97 per pound. And this one, the total price is $14.51. So we're gonna wrap this thing seasoning mix that we just made. So. We pick saute. Saute that one. And then you press this button. You, once you press this button, it will say preheating. Okay, so we leave it like that until the, the bowl we put olive oil. It's, it's uh, heated up already, so let's Yeah, uh, don't let any seasoning stick on the bottom. So just mix it, mix it, mix it until the uh, the bottom of the pot is uh, clean. Okay, and we put some onion. Okay, mix it. Mix the onion. Let it caramelize because 
onion when you uh, saute onion it will release the water or the liquid that's from the onion so that's what you want it then make the onion car caramelized okay uh, I think the onion is caramelized already so put some one tablespoon of chopped garlic mix it again Oops. adding Worcestershire sauce I'm sorry I don't know how to pronounce this sauce it's just so hard for me to pronounce it so I'm just gonna show it to you that sauce right there okay two tablespoons I got this uh, Porta Vela Masumi. Two cup of uh, beef broth. One cup of dry red wine. Dry red wine. Alright, so this is a uh, carrot. I'm gonna season it with uh, salt and pepper. Aluminum <laughs> foil. Okay, now I'm gonna put my, um, what's that, potato. <laughs> you know why I do this? Because if you put the potato and the carrots directly to the pot, then they're gonna get mushy. See, it's plenty of room. Look at this, because this thing is so big, so I have plenty of room. And that's it, guys. Now we're gonna put on the lid. All right. I'm gonna make sure to secure this lid and okay <clears throat> now I want to make sure to seal it you press that button to seal it to cover this one is still in salty uh, mode so you want to cancel it <clears throat> press cancel okay and you want to choose the pressure cooker okay pressure cooker and you want to put uh, one hour okay so just keep doing this one hour and you press one more time and right there preheating all right so we're gonna leave this for one hour and we'll check back again later okay all right one hour is up um the pressure cooker uh you know uh will make that sounds it's mean it's done leave it in about 10 minutes uh you know before we open the lid I put it too long. It should be, I mean, 10, 10 minutes or 15 minutes should be fine. Right? All right, so after um, 10 to 15 minutes, we, we put this, just put it like that. Oops. Like that. There you go. All right, <clears throat> let's open the lid. Ah, there you go. It smells so good. I'm going to take out this vegetable. We'll do something about it later. Put that thing right here. And this is the potato. Okay, right there. Mmm, look at that. That is looks good. Look at that. I'm gonna take the beef out. Okay. Look at that. Oh my god, that's so tender and juicy. Ooh. I need my two hands. Hold on one second. Oh, so here's our the meat. We're gonna leave this rest for about 10 minutes. 10 to all right. In the meanwhile, let's turn this thing on, and we are going to set it up as saute again. Okay, back to saute. Press this one two time. Okay, it's it's a preheating. This potato. If you like this uh, big size potato, it's fine. Or if you wanna cut it into little pieces. A little, like little, a little than this. That's fine. Also, it's up to you. I'm just gonna leave it like that, okay? And let's. Try. Uh, you can see it's boiling, okay? Now we're gonna put, we're gonna put our potato in there. Potato there. Right. Put it there. That. That's our carrot. Nice and soft. 
We're gonna put this carrot back into the pot, okay? starch mix that we made previously you mix it okay all right now we will cut this we're gonna cut this meat oh look at that juicy oh my gosh look at that it's so juicy guys Ooh. Look at this. Hey, why are you guys fighting? This girl can't get enough of wearing my clothes. Why don't you give it to her? Cause she's gonna make a mess. Yes, yeah, she is. Every time she goes in there. Oh my goodness, look at that beef, guys. Woo! Now, we're gonna put the beef in. All right. <clears throat> oh, look at that. Oh, it smells great. Smells so, so good. Oh my god. You mix it. So I'm gonna serve this uh, pot rolls with Italian loaf. I'm gonna warm this up. I serve it <laughs> with bread. All right, this is my husband. Go ahead, husband. Mm, let's see what we got here. What's in there? Is it good? Mm, mm. <laughs> it's good, right? Eat it with mm, bread. Mm. You dip the bread into that sauce. Daddy, you gotta taste oh this with the soup. <laughs> Not just bread. That's fine, that's fine. Eat one bread. In the soup. Mm. Good, good? Let's try it. Good, good? Mm -hmm. Mm. Hold on. Delicioso. Delicioso? Oh yeah. This is Zoe, this is your food right here. What do you think, Rizal? Oh my god, look at that. Please. Mm. <coughs> the beef just honey. The beef is so soft. The beef is so soft and the the vegetable is not mushy. You know, look at that. Still the perfect shape. But it's soft. Potato? Mm. The potato is perfect. This is the portabella mushroom. It's hard not to eat noisy. Portabella mushroom. Mm. This is like the best, the best stew I've ever made. You want to try it with bread? Mm. So good. Mm. So good. Mm. It tastes the texture. Wow. Whatever he says. Mm. You should try it at home. Overall, I like the pressure cooker. I think the advantage of the pressure cooker is great because I can cook with rice. I can saute there. Beef stew, soup, uh, I can even make yogurt, okay. so many. One pot and you can use it for so many things, so it's just awesome, it's great, I love it. Right, thank you guys for watching, see you on my next video, bye!